if you wanted to stick with a two piece, this is how it looks like. Okay, let's do the next one. Okay, so, so far, I mean, I know it's not too revealing, but it still gives you something. If you're not comfortable with a bikini without a sleeve, then this is definitely a good one. You can still look cute in rock. All right? All eyes on me. <laughs> All right, so. channel this is your girl ivy and today we are doing a bikini haul if this is your first time stopping by thank you guys for stopping by my channel i hope you are here to stay don't forget to like subscribe and share and to all of my returning subscribers thank you guys so much for the love and support i love you so much let's get into the video so as you all know i was having a bit of an issue trying to find um the size that fit me perfectly well. Sometimes it's either I have an issue with the top being too small or right here a bit tighter. Okay, so now I am going to be trying on a different size, which is a 0XL. Okay, I wanted to move up a bit and see if it would fit me. All right, so normally I wear a medium and a large, but then sometimes, <laughs> I don't know what happens, it wouldn't fit. But yeah, let me go ahead and let you see the pieces that I picked up and I hope you enjoy it. If you want to see what I have today, keep watching. So here is the first three piece. As you can see, it has a string and it was actually easy to put it on, okay? I put on the top, the neck one, and then I actually decided to tie it in the back, okay? But um, when I got the bikini, it was tied in the front, okay? So this is how I did mine, and it's cute. It's, it's cute, and it covers my boobs, so I guess the top, 0XL in the top. Overall, I like it. I love it because with this, you can change it any style you want. You can pull it up, you can pull it down, and the mesh gives it a little more flair but it's it's beautiful i like it um, i'm glad i got it so the top will be a 10 for me and then the bottom the mesh is great but the bikini bottom itself is actually a bit tighter okay so that is the only thing i have about that but overall i love it okay so yeah if you wanted to stick with a two-piece this is how it looks like but I'm definitely going to be putting uh, the um, third piece on there, the mesh on there, because as I said, it's a bit too tight. And that's it. That's what I have. Okay, so definitely going to put the mesh on there. You already saw how it looked, but I love the top. You know, it gives you some style and flair, some cuts. So it's not just a plain, simple pair of the bag. Okay, let's do the next one. For the second bikini, it is a long sleeve tie-dye bikini, and it's a two-piece. As you can see, this is still a 0XL, and the top is very sassy. <laughs> you know, as you can see, it has some strings that goes down, and I tied mine in the back. You know, so it's pretty fly if you don't want to show a whole lot more as you already know i love high-waisted bikinis it's a bit tight but it's too cute to pass on so definitely a good bikini to have if you're not comfortable with it you can just put cover up at the bottom the top is nice okay so so far i mean i know it's not too revealing but 
it still gives you something. If you're not comfortable with bikini without a sleeve, then this is definitely a good one. You can still look cute and rock. All right? All eyes on me. <laughs> so this bikini top can definitely pass for a top. You know, you can just wear this with a cute jeans or high-waisted, you know, skirt. What do you think? I mean, it looks too cute. The design is so great. And you can just tie it up either in the front or in the back. I decided to do that in the back. Okay, so there you have it. The number two bikini. <laughs> So here we have the third bikini. As you can see, it's a two-piece bikini. It's still padded. All the bikinis that I wore today are all padded. So yeah, if you wanted to take the pad out, you could. If you wanted to keep it, that is also <laughs> up to you. I love this bikini. I mean, there's a lot of colors, but if you love colors, then this shouldn't be a bad idea okay so definitely a good one this actually gives me a full coverage the, I, I don't even understand it's the same zero xl but then some would be too tight even though they were not all full coverage but at least you know it should still fit right but no this one is so far the one that actually you know feels a bit comfortable in that all right so this one is by far the one that, you know, people, anyone who don't feel comfortable showing too much, you know, this is it. It has this string, this string here. It has this here. This is actually nothing. It doesn't really do much with it, with the bikini actually, but you can take it off if you want it or just leave it in as it came in. All right. So leaving it in. You tie it up any way you want and this is it okay so if you wanted to take it out you could if you want to leave it in that is fine too but this is how it looks it's padded and the back is full coverage and it's a high-waisted you already know I love high-waisted bikinis so yes this is it bikini number three let me know which one is your favorite and comment down below all right so let's go to the next bikini imagine me sipping martini at the beach huh i don't even know how to drink all right i'm just so the fourth bikini is also a tie-dye and look at the neck it's so beautifully shaped so differently and it's padded it's giving me the coverage that i need just like the other ones at the top okay and this is also a high waisted this is not to a full coverage 100 percent, but it's still good all right so if you wanted to get a bikini that still gives you a uh oomph all right this is good. All right. I love the color. I love the color. It's, it's very simple. And sometimes simple goes a long way. You don't need too much going on. Just you and your bikini or whatever you have. And you're golden. Okay. You have to feel confident in yourself. And don't listen to what people say. Okay. Some people just say something bitter because they used to, either they're having a bad day or they just jealous they can't be you okay you or yourself be yourself and do what makes you happy not a bad bikini to have so now i see that the zero xl the top is definitely a good coverage for me but then the bottoms some may be okay some may not but overall i would take it all right all right rather than having a bikini that both <laughs> the top and the bottom are too small for me all right but if you ship like me, I just want you to know this is how it's going to look on you. All right. So you, overall, 
not bad they kill it all to the next one to the next one i know most of you missed this video <laughs> all right don't forget my channel is good for everything all right so stick with me and you'll definitely be getting the videos that you like all right let's go to the final look for the day this is the three piece the final look for the day i just wanted you to see the two piece portion remember i had said first i used to get a large or extra large and a medium sometimes fit but this zero xl definitely fit the top look good so i now i know zero xl for the top will be a good top to have based on my cup size all right so now i know that I will not be doing the mini ones again <laughs> all right so now i know all right so this is the two-piece portion of it white it looks very good and it feels comfortable all right it's high-waisted i wanted to get something that um a lot of people will feel comfortable wearing so that's why i did that all right because most, most of the bikinis that i did previously were a bit on the skinny level size all right but this type is good today uh good for the plus size people like us all right <laughs> all right oh anyone who don't feel comfortable is showing a whole lot so this is the third piece of it all right you can choose not to tie it up it's a mesh but jeans type top okay you can choose to leave it open but you can also tie it up, all right? So you have the coverage that you want and still look good. So this is it, all right? This is the three piece, the final look for the day. I hope you like this because I love it, all right? This is simple, but elegant. That was what I was going for today. So all my plus size girls, like more, can actually find something comfortable if they haven't looked these are from Shein 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 zero XL these are the padded bikinis so this this is padded as well you can choose to take the pad out but I didn't all right so whatever makes you comfortable I love the sleeve all right if you wanted to use it for a different bikini that is perfectly fine you can even wear it on something you know you can use it aside just a bikini right you can just wear it by itself take the 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 second piece of the bra part off and just tie this and tie it up if you're comfortable that will be your bikini top i mean everybody's different some people don't have a problem doing that others still do have an issue all right so it's up to you your comfort level don't try to do something that you're not comfortable with, all right? It takes practice, okay? So if you're not comfortable in your own skin, I understand it's okay. But then the more you do it, the better you get at it, okay? Rome wasn't built in a day, all right? So as you all know, you saw my first video. I'm still working on improving it, making it vibe. <laughs> all right, so yes. Hope to see you in the next video. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share if you haven't done so already. I love you guys. Mwah.